Pay for it. Over a grand, but mm. it's not fun. Sorry, it's it's, it's not, prices it's not, Hello. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Could you explain what this is to the viewers at home in black and white? This, my friends, is a triple A board. <laughs> um, it's yeah, Dave Haney's old to play board with all full blown <laughs> schematics. Look at that beauty! All commented, all with the trademark um, lyrics on the bottom, what I was going to put on. Survive, so, stay alive through the thick and the thick. Fantastic. Uh, Dave, oh god! <laughs> and, yeah. Engineering for the masses. Every single bit of information on the play board, including all the registers. Fantastic. So, well, that's technically, there's enough here to finish it. Though. At least the, you've got what each register does. The, uh, this is it AAA? Does it actually, is it complete enough to work? Or does it, is no, it's no. missing no. all the custom chips. So it's missing all that, yeah. I um, just didn't know what, it's, yeah. It was rigged I don't know up what as a, stage they got to with it. No, it's rigged up as a 32-bit system, because there would have yeah. been slots there for the extra 64-bit yeah. balance yeah. up there. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, this is the one where they put the sim in yeah. slightly the wrong angle and blew everything up. Yeah. Uh, so got all the different modules there. That's the graphics RAM yeah. that would have plugged in yeah. there, and that's where the reworks um, to get round. Um, I see there's not much really working plunge. on the board at all, is it? No, no, there, that's it. It's just standard chips now. They pulled it when this oh. went, so they pulled oh. all the good chips off and used them on everything else. Replates. So anything that wasn't worth changing, they left. Um, the only thing I will proctor and Yeah. And that's the main difference about this to the normal Amigas is they've got loads of different clocks, all slightly offset, all different frequencies. So the data would have been ready on the bus as soon as the CPU well, is needed, yeah. um, for it. Um, um, so far I sourced a SCSI chip and a network chip for it. And those weren't on it originally. What are your plans for this? To see if you can fire it up. Finish it. Finish it. Finish it. <laughs> um, I'm just not destroying anything. I mean, there's, there's loads of reworks I'm not going to touch. Um, I've found adapters that will replace those two adapters, um, which I can just plug an FPGA in and top off. This is a life job. It's not going to get But it's something to play with. I and mean, there's, there's all the specs. How does enhancing the video slot under the video output 23 in one to have monitor identification on it? So what are these for? Those are test headers, those have been removed on the final version. Uh, it's just a logic analyzer. Well, I'm not worried about the Benjamin Band. <laughs> it arrived really bad. And it, it arrived with a battery on that corroded all over here. So it's pulled off the board. And Traditional Commodore style. Traditional, yes. Um, oh, you've got to have a board with yeah. slightly yeah. greeny blue gun yeah. on, so it's not right. If they don't self destruct, you'd never buy a new one, would you? It's upside down! It's upside down! I was obviously going to take it off and put the uh, thing on this, but. Yeah. 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 Pardon? A lot of in-house chips. A lot of in-house chips. Right. Yeah, I know it's the standard Amiga chips, the Buster and that. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they formed them out though, eventually, didn't they? Well, I know, the interesting thing is the yeah. registers for the um, custom chips that it's going to make yeah. are PCI compatible. They're uh, all PCI yeah. stuff. So, yeah, they long term, they want dark day long term they're going to go PCI. Dave was not dark by any chance of this. Well, that was a, that was a logical step, weren't it, to go PCI? Well, yeah, do a hybrid first, have PCI slots and the custom chips plugged in on a PCI card, and then oh, yeah. Yeah. Bus, go completely the retired full board. and just pull the card out. So, full ISA came out. Sorry. Sorry, PDX ISA. That's pretty much it we've got. All the information. Have you uh, copied any of that, documented any of it? I haven't got around to it yet. Oh, you've got, got to. You should, you should scan it and put it on the PDF. Find a scanner for that. It's a bit more of a matching up. I can resize it and work down to A4, but I can't. They've got to be archived, haven't they? Oh, God.
Where's the thing? It was well. Oh, it's folding well. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I've got an A4000 T and an A4000 downstairs that are playing up, obviously. They're playing up. That's kind of rare, but it's not uh, just expensive. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, they got the data just the long way around the way to the wires. Yeah, and so we all made a mistake there. Oh yeah. Uh, so we that's the editor on it. Uh, and uh, and uh, 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 the Head like an old buck as you saw. You're more the guy that gives you control. Yeah. Gotta write these down. Head like a hole. Back as a soul. I'd rather die than give you my control.